Hey up everyone, Magpie Gaming here bringing you another Escape from Tarkov quest video. This time we're looking at Shortage for the Therapist. This is the very first quest that you get for the Therapist and it's one that you just want to gonna get out the way and move on to the next quests that she has. So for this quest you need to hand in three Salewa first aid kits. Now these are abundant throughout the game. There's no one real place within the game where you'll find them more than others. There's a few places where they have a higher chance of spawning but really you can get them anywhere in the game. So look in the medical bags, look in the boxes, look in the crates, look everywhere. Anywhere that you can actually search for an item, search and you might find a Salewa kit. Look at dead PMCs, dead scavs, the scavs you kill, you know, look everywhere and you will most likely find them fairly quickly. Also look on beds, tabletops, the tops of crates and things like that, they will randomly just be scattered around. Now that's the good old fashioned way of doing it, if you don't want to go through the game looking for them, you can craft them in your hideout. Now you are going to need med station level 1, but that is pretty easy to achieve you will just need your generator up and running and then the med station level one is 20,000 rubles I believe and at the first level you can create Salewa kits. To do so you will need one, uh, you'll need two lots of painkillers, an antiseptic bandage and an immobilizing splint. I think it's two bandages? Yeah it is, it's two bandages. So that's two lots of painkillers, two lots of bandages and one splint and you will be able to create a Salewa kit. I think it takes around 30, 33 minutes, something like that. So it wouldn't take too long and you have all three of them to hand over and that is pretty much it. Now these Salewa kits can be in any condition, they can be half used or full, it doesn't really matter, you should still be able to hand them over. I have only ever handed them over when they've been, you know, full 400 points on them but I'm reliably informed by the Tarkov wiki that you can actually hand them in with any condition. And that is pretty much it for this quest ladies and gentlemen, a very easy one. Kind of just updating this because of the changes that have been made with patch 12.9 so it, yeah it's free kits, it used to be a lot more I think. So yeah, that is it. So as always, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching and listening. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Stay safe and I will catch you in the next one. Take care.